What is up guys, I bring you another FIFA 13 review and we're going to be talking about the awesome Inform Mikkeli. Now so many people have requested me to review this person because of how awesome his card stats are. But is he worth it? Let us find out. I got him on the PS3 for 80k. Now he will be going down in price. I know I overpaid but I wanted to get this review out as soon as possible. But he will be going down by the end of the week. So if you wait a bit more he will be cheaper and also um, the inform and the non-inform there isn't that big of a price difference so you you should take that into consideration but is it worth paying the extra coinage the biggest um the biggest noticeable difference for me with the inform is that his shot power has definitely been upgraded i was able to score a couple of long shots with him and i did feel that his shot was much more powerful and that is really great but then again i was really disappointed with his pace the reason i say this is because he has really high acceleration rate but then he only has 82 sprint speed so he does slow down quite a lot after he accelerates for a couple of yards so you guys have to take that into consideration as well and Another thing that is bad about him is he's five foot six, so he is useless to, to head of the ball at all. He won't beat defenders in uh, in in the air, so you could forget about him in the air. Also, he is very fucking weak. So if you wanna um, if you want a striker that could bodge off defenders, forget about this guy as well because he's just too damn weak. Another thing that's so awesome about him is his dribbling. So if you want uh, a striker that has really awesome dribbling, four star skills and four star weak foot, go away ahead this man is the man for you left foot strikes right foot it doesn't matter just take them and he will score because of how awesome his shot power is another awesome thing about him is he's got some I think he has the best free kick stats in the whole of Ultimate Team. He even has better free kick stats than Ronaldo himself. So that is another big um, attribute that will give him a lot of points. So if you want a really awesome free kick taker get Mikkeli. He also has po uh, really good passing attributes so if you want to play uh, Inform Mikkeli in different positions you can because he can play in the striking role, centre forward, um, centre attacking midfielder and just a normal centre midfielder. So you could play him in numerous positions if you're not happy with him in a striking role. But that is pretty much it. All I have to say about Mikkeli, um, if you want, let me know in the comment section below who you want me to review next. Also guys, if you have yet to follow me on Twitter or Facebook, please do so because sometimes we have some pretty interesting discussions about Ultimate Team and real life football and sometimes some messed up shit. But other than that, hope you guys really enjoyed this video and as usual, I hope you have a very nice day.